Hey boys and girls. Yeah, been a minute, right? It's May 29th, 2019 edition of Anse. And yes, it's I. Da 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 da. And man. Um, how you guys doing? I know it's been a minute, right? Uh, say I get to do an essay since I ain't done one in a while. Uh, as you can see, I'm still the same size, still the same color, still the same attitude. Uh, happy, happy, joy, joy, no more, no less. Um, uh, it's summertime now, and it just past Memorial Day weekend, which make me come to an answer. You know, not an important essay, but just one I, I said I've done one in a while, so let me just shoot the breeze on the one. And uh, y'all all have been begging me to do one for a while, so here it goes. I just I was just wondering though, though. Said, like I said Memorial Day weekend just passed, just literally just passed, and 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 I realized that we as people always got to. Uh, regionalize our foods. When did that come to be? Why the us being United United States of America, keyword United. <laughs> why it's so important to know where our foods, not where it come from, but where it was from when it was made, like Philly cheese sandwich or. New York style pizza, or Chicago style pizza, or Kansas City barbecue, or Memphis barbecue, or list goes on and on, like Kentucky Fried Chicken. Like, why is so important where these wonderful um, foods come from? Like, I know someone in France or somewhere in Italy is like, fuck. You. Oh, I was cursed, and I'm sorry. Uh, put F there. <laughs> Blank you, U.S., for taking out pizza and running with it. Like, this is an Italian dish. Last time I checked, strobonis and stuff. Like, that's ours. How you gonna run with that? I mean, well, we, well, we, we, we make Civil War out of dishes just to make them sound greater. And just, you no. Know, let them be. Let them be just a cheeseburger. Why it gotta be a, a, a American cheeseburger? What what what's the difference between an American cheeseburger and a cheeseburger in another country? What the difference? Is it the still ground beef? It's so stupid, you know. And and we make I say with outright civil war when you go to people uh picnics and houses and you have like. Family members from other parts of the country come visit, and they taste certain people's foods. And like that's not like how we do it oh, where we from. And like, okay, that's even better. Why do you want your stuff to taste the same everywhere you go? Ah, it's so mad. It's not about the food. It's just the idea that you are not willing to, to try new things. I said it's not even about food no more. It's about you separating something that shouldn't be separated. But you, you, in your pride, whoever you may be, have to regionalize your stuff and or have members of your family who does and accept that for what it is. Uh, no, 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 go back to pizza again. A Hawaiian pizza. Why, why can't I just have a pizza with pineapples and ham? Why just can't be a pizza with pineapple and ham? Why I gotta be Hawaiian? Why have it? That's the re region again. Like, oh no, it's just weird to me how you know we we always get. You no, know, my friends, you a big fan of um, uh, Wendy's Southwestern uh, salad? Ooh, they have black beans on it. Not Southwestern. Get out of here, please. Uh, got corn. Ooh. It's just stupid to me, and man, and I had to rent on something since I haven't done one in a while. And I'm sipping on Kool Aid, and I'm feeling great. So, uh, on that note, 
been a while, but I miss you guys. And that was my essay.